Hey everybody, Michael from Skills PT Academy. Really hope everybody is doing fantastic. I'm back with yet another video on writing a perfect essay, avoiding all the mistakes, and using the right template in 2024 to get that perfect 90 in writing. Before we get into the video, if you can subscribe to this channel, kindly click on the subscribe button and anytime you need online assistance, it's a paid assistance, you can WhatsApp us to the number appearing at the bottom of the screen. I'll be there, we will be there to help you guide in the right direction. Alright, without further delay, let's straight away get right into the video. Let me just share my screen, write essay in 2024 as well. It looks something like this, you will have 20 minutes to write an essay. There would be a question, there would be a box inside that you need to write, cut, copy, paste, you hardly use it. Once done, you will click the next button. What if I don't click the next button? <laughs> within 20 minutes, let's say 20 minutes is passed. If I don't click the next button, will the essay be auto-saved? Yes, it will be auto-saved, but remember the timing will be somewhere on the top right. Somewhere on the top right, the time, uh, the timer will indicate you how much time you are left with. And word count also will be somewhere here, word, total word count, 3, 5, 10, whatever it is, it will be displayed. You need to write between 200 to 300 words. All right, so let's understand the evaluation criteria first and then I'm going to show you two templates that will definitely work in 2024 and then I'm going to show you how to avoid the grammatical errors. It's going to be a lengthy video. I'm going to show you how to avoid the grammatical errors, how to make simple sentence, compound sentence, complex sentences and then we take up a question and I have not prepared for that question. I just know the question. I'm going to show you how I struggle writing the entire essay. Uh, how I type the essay, how I frame the sentence, everything you will understand how to write a perfect essay in this video. Make sure you watch till the end, let's quickly start with how you are evaluated by the software, Pearson says content is to mark, form, form meaning, it should be between 200 to 300 words, this is what Pearson says. Grammatical grammar should be 2 marks, vocabulary 2 marks, general linguistic range is all about how varied things you know like for example, you can talk about uh, the gerund forms, complex sentences and different you know like general linguistic range is all about having a better English in terms of varied uh, forms, different sentences, phrases, figure of speech, a lot many things that will give you 2 marks. Development and structure that is called coherence and cohesion, how you develop the essay. This is all about linking words. This is because in the end, furthermore, additionally, firstly, that is the development and structure 2 marks and spelling 2 marks. But of all the things, what is more important is this, this and this. Take a screenshot, it is something really important. Form is very important, grammar is very important and spelling is very important. Rest vocabulary you do not have to worry, general linguistic range you do not have to worry, development and structure you do not have to worry because we have done that hard work and homework to give you the template which covers this everything. Content is you need to write something at least. So, definitely this is also an important you know I mean to some extent, but what is more important is spelling, form and grammar remember this. So, in this video I will be showing you how to make sure we get 2 marks for each. All right. So, template in 2024, avoid using those templates which allow you to write only two sentences on your own, one sentence on your own or no sentences on your own or one keyword on your own. Avoid them, I am telling you, you will not get scores, 100 percent, 100 percent. So, use something of this if this template works, uh, wherein the first and the last para will have very minimal to write. Here a constructive dialogue on one word you write. And uh, my view is that you will write your view here. I am going to show you how to write the entire template. Here firstly, first sentence. This is because second sentence, for example, third sentence. Another interesting point is that fourth sentence. This is mainly due to the fact that fifth sentence. The five sentences. The five sentence essay template is what I would recommend everyone to follow. Any template is fine. This is also fine as long as the template gives you the freedom to write five sentences on your own. And if you properly observe, firstly, this is because for example, in conclusion, another interesting point, this is mainly due to the fact to quote an example and hence, and hence. So, all these the highlighted one in red are the coherence and cohesion. 
the development and structure. So, SAO automatically covers that you just have to blindly follow and make sure you write some good things inside it. All right, and again it is not basically what you write, it is basically how you write that is simple sentence, compound sentence, complex sentence, we will talk in just a while. This is one of the templates, you do not have to take up you know picture the entire template is uh, written in the description of this video if you want you can take a picture as well. This is another template a similar template the last paragraph is written the same way. The first paragraph is where one such topic is you write one word my view is that you write your view. Second paragraph to begin with uh, there I wrote there are number of reasons here to begin with any template you can use to begin with one prominent aspect of topic is first sentence. This is because second sentence to quote a recent instance third sentence. Secondly one notable feature is fourth sentence this is due to the fact that fifth sentence this is also five uh, sentences a template. I can use this or that both are giving good marks uh, today is Jan 12th I am making this video. Uh, I am not sure when it will be posted, I think Jan 13th or 14th it will be posted, but Jan 12th we have a student Gautamam has got 90 overall. Another person Gauss who also got 90 writing, but speaking went down, so we have not shared. You can check the same score report in the YouTube community post of our channel, he has used this template, although such topics you can rely on me. All right, so let us continue any of the two templates is fine, um, but yes what is important when I told you both the templates had five sentences to be written, right. S C C X what is this S is simple sentence, C is compound sentence, C X is complex sentence. I want you to write a mixture of these, there are five sentences, maybe you can write two simple sentence, one compound, two complex or three complex, one compound, one simple, three simple, one compound, one complex, it is up to you. But at least um, one, one compound, one complex, one simple minimum should be there for a better score. Remember this, so what is this compound complex sentence? Anything which does not include any connectors is a simple sentence. TV is the main reason for its low score in education, I am not using any and, but or so they are connectors. If I use them, it becomes a compound sentence. TV is the, sorry we will come here, we will come to third one. TV is the main reason for his low score in education, that is what we wrote in the first sentence, comma and he has started performing very bad. First sentence, simple sentence, second simple sentence, in between you add a connector and or but or fanboys we call for and or but or it. So, it becomes a compound sentence. So, compound sentence is made up of two simple sentences. So, what about complex sentence? There is one more term called subordinate conjunctions, though, although, even though, despite, since, in spite of, with, because, due to this, they are all complex and they are all subordinate conjunctions. When you use them, it becomes a complex sentence. Though TV is the main reason for his low score in education, it has given you enough knowledge. Or you can say TV is the main reason for his low score in education, though it has given him enough knowledge. You got to make use of these three sentences for a better score, trust me on this. Let us um, categorize them into simple, compound and complex sentences. This town is a popular place which is really good for tourists. Which it is not just though, although, even though, since, uh, despite, in spite of, amid, it is also the word which, where, that. All these words make it a relative clause which is also in a way a complex sentence. First is a complex sentence and is there compound sentence. Full stop is there. This town is a popular place, simple sentence. It is really good for tourists, two simple sentences. Although came, so it is a complex sentence. Any doubts do leave a comment in the comment section, but we are going to make use of all this and try to write a perfect essay in just a while. All right, so we will move on. Let us take some questions before I start showing you how I myself write the essay. Probably I will finish the essay in 8 minutes because it is not really required to take 20 minutes for the essay, we will show you. So, how much marks does I say give, not gives, it is give, very sorry on that typo, it is not 90, it is 8 to 12, 1 essay. If 2 essay comes, 20, not more than that. Remember I used your template, I got 45 writing, you use someone's template, you get 45 writing only because the problem is reading, writing, fill in the blank, listening, fill in the blank, write from dictation, these 3 contribute the remaining 70 marks, 75 marks towards your writing. 
But yes, this is also important here it is very crucial that you have to get 20 out of 20. So, that other modules are little difficult still you hold a chance to get that 79. Hope you are getting it. If 2 essay appears max 20 marks are there any changes in 2024 definitely yes. uh, starting in the month of 2023 uh, November this all started when I believe the recent update happened. What is the change avoid using one word template or one sentence template. I use only two sentences small small and finish it off wrap it up 50 possible 58 possible 65 79 not possible I am telling you. Use template where you fill sentences on your own at least 5 sentences and write 240 plus words if possible that is a, a new thing, um, but nothing much to worry do not write 201, 203. We have not seen low scores, but we have seen people getting good scores when they write above 230, 240. So, I am just recommending in the worst case it is still fine 210, but try to write 240 plus 2, do not write 290 and all 240, 250, 235 on an ideal, you know on an average will definitely fetch you good scores. All right. So, how many words should I write? Like I just explained 200 to 300 minimum you need to write to get the 2 marks for the form. 240 is an ideal one. 235, 240, 245, 250, 225, 230 somewhere around that. But if you do not write between 200 to 300 definitely the marks will be unexpected trust me on this. Okay. Only one template is enough for all the essays? Yes, because content is not a priority. I am not saying content is not important. Content may be important, but it is not a priority meaning for any question use the same template. It is totally fine. You do not have to use different different templates like in IELTS. Trust me on this one template is enough no need to have different essay template I am going to show you. Um, for any question let us say let us talk about a question here all the such topics. How do we write this for problem solution essay? problem solution for environmental problems. A constructive dialogue on environment can lead to thought provoking discussions. My view is that irrespective of the numerous argument that exist on either side tell your view. I do not have a view because it is problem solution I need a different template no no same template. My view is that irrespective of the numerous argument that exist on either side this essay has both problems and solutions. Simple advantage out uh, you know I um, mean the disadvantages this essay will have both advantages and disadvantages. Law changes human behavior, agree, disagree. My view is that irrespective of the numerous arguments that exist on either side, law will definitely change the human behavior. You are telling your view. So, you can alter it the way you want it because the essay has been made in a way that it fits for any kind of question. Hope you are getting it. If it is advantage, outweigh disadvantage, you write the advantage here, you write the disadvantage here. Knuckle for disadvantage, you cannot write another interesting, do not put lot of sense into it because the software is not putting, you do not have to really worry. I am guaranteeing you. For advantage, outweigh disadvantage, probably you should write on one hand and next para on the other hand, that is for IELTS. Here it is not required, I am telling you. Here, what is given more importance is spelling and grammar, not the content. Hope it is clear. Now we will take up a question. I am going to show you how I struggle or how I make it more smoother and finish the essay in 8 minutes. Let us see, this is the question. As global trade increases between different countries, read the question, many daily necessities are produced in other countries. Such goods are usually transported for a long distance. Do the benefits of this trend outweigh the drawbacks? It is advantage, outweigh disadvantage. Okay, outweigh whatever it does not matter. In IELTS, all these are important. In PTE, it is not you just have to write some advantages and disadvantages finish it off. Now, how to generate the keywords anything that comes to your mind write something between transportation, long distance, necessities, global trade these things whatever the idea you write should revolve around this. So, that the AI software so called AI software will get you get you know I mean the better marks. So, now if you write the keywords benefits yes we get to a different kind of food blueberry, strawberry dates will not get in India we will get from Dubai. These are the benefits. We get to eat different varieties of foods. It may not be a great idea, it could be a bad idea, it is still fine. You will not get low scores. You get low scores when you make spelling mistakes, you get low scores when you do not write compound complex simple sentences. Hope you are getting it. Drawbacks, you full pollution because a truck has to be transported for a very long distance. Sorry, the food has to be transported in a truck for a very long distance. That is it. So, now three things to be kept in mind. Do not worry about the content whatever comes to your mind 
you write. Do not have to use your Einstein's brain to the full capacity to generate the ideas, 10 percent of your capacity enough. The rest 90 percent, relax and use the rest 90 percent for grammar and spelling check. Do not have to produce a logically correct sequence not required. Oh, this is not making sense, I think this is wrong and whatever that comes to your mind, you write. You have read the question, definitely you only think about that question and write somewhere similar to that you would have written enough. Just write related to the topic, I am going to show you how do I write it. So, the first para I have already written, last para you do not have to put any words. So, first and last I will just show you and then second and third I will just write in front of you right now and see what all mistakes I make. Although such topics in all likelihood never will yield, never will yield or will never yield it does not matter grammarly or some other software may show something else, but people are getting 90 with this. This is uh, the right information. This is working, this will work, do not have to worry. Never will yield a consensual agreement, a constructive dialogue on, I took one keyword from the question. Global trade can lead to constructive dialogue on, transportation of food can lead to thought provoking discussions. My view is that irrespective of the numerous argument that exists on either side, advantages outweigh disadvantage or disadvantages outweigh advantages. Now, should I write two advantages and one disadvantage? There is all those are only for IELTS. Here you write some advantage, you write some disadvantage, you will get the marks. See, try to understand what exactly I am talking about. It is a computer, it will not know you have proved advantage out to a part is proved. No, it is only focusing more on spelling and the grammar. As long as, as you write some advantage and disadvantage, you are going to get the marks. Or if you really want, you prove it outweigh part, but it is not required. That is exactly what I am talking about. The number of reasons in favor of my viewpoint, firstly here first sentence, this is because for instance, three sentences. Another interesting point is that fourth sentence, this is mainly due to the fact that fifth sentence, I am going to show you how do I do that. So, this is the question I have just written uh, somewhere here. Uh, it is about goods travel to a long distance, benefits outweigh the drawbacks, I am just removing it off. We are going to talk about benefits in the first paragraph. We get to eat variety of foods. There are a number of reasons in fa favor of my viewpoint. Firstly, with the transportation of food for a long distance, people get a chance to eat foods other than local food other than indigenous crops. Anything you can write if you have a better English grammar, anything is fine. See, I am not really prepared for this, I am not lying. I am just writing because that is how essay writing is. This is because, now I am just writing the first sentence with the transportation of food for a long distance comma complex sentence. This is because, <coughs> now we need to write why uh, people get a chance to eat food other than indigenous food? This is because when again complex sentence, when food is transported, people can rely not just on locally produced food, but also on food that is grown in a foreign nation, same thing only I am just beating around the bush. For example, in Dubai or in Saudi you can say dates are grown and due to global trade, it is possible to transport them to other nations. Again, this is and it is a compound sentence, um, when food is transported complex sentence with the transportation complex sentence. I have to write one simple sentence, we will write another interesting point is that we finished we get to eat different varieties of foods. That is it done and dusted, now we will write pollution. Another interesting point is that global trade can cause pollution. I wrote a simple sentence done. This is mainly due to the fact that to transport food across long distances, the truck needs to be 
filled with food and taken along producing humongous amount of gases in the form of exhaust that is it done and dusted. My essay is done. Now, cool, it is not really making so much sense no not required. Grammatical is it correct? Yes, I have a simple sentence here. I have uh, to transport food across long distance, truck needs to be filled with food and taken the long producing blah 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 compound complex. I wrote to, to do this comma complex sentence and taken the long the truck needs to be filled with food and taken the long producing compound sentence. Complex compound sentence is what I have written here simple sentence here complex sentence complex sentence complex three complex sentence one simple sentence one compound complex sentence essay is done and tested other than spelling mistakes with dubai d capital it's okay you can write small it's easy what you need to focus is something else what people focus is something else grammar and spelling you focus more template don't worry template is not going to give you mark inside the template five sentences that will give you the better marks Hope you are getting it. So, in 2024, 20, if you ask me which template to follow, any template or either of the templates that I have given, but use a template wherein you write 5 sentences out of this 5, at least 1 simple, 1 compound, 1 complex sentence that should be there and 0 spelling mistakes. If you ask me, finish the essay in 12 or 14 minutes, the rest of the time, 6 minutes, total is 20 minutes, right? The remaining 6 minutes, use it to proofread for spelling. One spelling mistakes cost you 2 marks. Let us say you made 10 spelling mistakes. Mostly you are going to get 0 marks. This people do not realize. All right. I really hope this video made sense. Uh, I really believe you produce an informative content. If you feel the same, then please do like, share and subscribe with your friends. Um, with this, I am going to park this video here. This is Nakul N-A-K-U-L. Nakul signing off from Skills PT Academic. Soon we will be back. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.